Welcome to Stone Ridge Homestead. I am Rooted Dreamer and today we are going to talk about what the new surprise is on our homestead. Big things happening. So excited! <music> Getting ready for the next big thing on the homestead, the surprise. So he is leveling. He took out, wow, took out all those trees. He's been busy. I leave for a couple of days. Let me tell you, he gets some stuff done. Wow. The other day, I uh, videoed. Paul, he was leveling out the ground. He took out some trees and he made a burn pile because he had so many trees that he just decided to burn it. So this all has to be uh, gotten rid of before the big addition comes. Over here in this corner, he took out some crepe myrtles. He also had to take out my butterfly bushes and we transplanted them, we've watered them, but as you can see, this one's not doing so great. Uh, we put the other one by the gate down here. It's looking a little better. It might make it. I gotta get some water on it today. So I had to sacrifice two butterfly bushes, but it will be worth it. Currently this project has been paused for just a little while because Paul is in New York. He likes to go on mission trips every so often. He goes once or twice a year, but he had to miss during COVID. So he was anxious to get back. He goes up to the Christian camps up there. There's a Christian camp. He does, there's one in California. There's one in New York. And he volunteers his time and his work. And he builds and remodels and does basically anything they need to do construction wise for them. So he's gone for the week. But here are some shenanigans that he got into before he left. I was up checking the upper 40 acres, the high chaparral, seeing how the corn was doing up there. Doing fine. The chicken doesn't like me being this close to it. So that motorbike that he was on, he's actually taking it up to New York with him and he's going to leave it there. He's donating it to the camp because the camps are usually so spread out. It's just more convenient to get on a, a little motorbike like that and take off. And we have so much stuff on our property now. There's not really any sense to, to have it. It's just because, I mean, it's just as easy to walk and trying to get around things. It's just, it's too crowded <laughs> to have a motorbike. So he's donating it to the camp up there. I think he's kind of sad to see it go, but reality's setting in that he's there's, he, it just sits for most of the year. They'll be getting more use out of it up there at the camp. While I was recording, I just happened to look over and I see something exciting. My tiny Tim, 
tomatoes have turned red. Yay! We get some little, our very first tomatoes of the season. I planted them right here next to the basil. Mm. Oh, I wish this was smell-o-vision. It smells divine. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned to see what our big surprise is. It's coming up very soon. Until next time, may the Lord bless you and keep you.